bring your friends to this fantastic beachfront house. Matthew Perry is no exception to the various celebrities who have owned huge high-end luxury houses in Malibu throughout the years. Hey guys, and welcome back to the channel. For this video, we will discover inside Matthew Perry's $13.5 million Malibu beach house. But before anything else, please leave a like on the video. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and click the notification bell down below so you won't miss our videos. Without any further ado, let's hop on right to the video. What makes you want to live in Malibu? After all, Malibu is recognized across the globe for its magnificent coastal hills that descend precipitously into soft-sanded Pacific beaches, as well as its Mediterranean climate and celebrity inhabitants like Will Smith, Leonardo DiCaprio, and Pierce Brosnan. However, if high-profile inhabitants, pleasant weather, and a gorgeous beachfront are the primary reasons for moving to Malibu, there are other options, such as La Jolla, California, or Kahala, Hawaii. Perry has offered his kick-ass Malibu mansion, as he dubbed it on social media, for $14.95 million. The actor reduced the asking price by a million dollars to $13.95 million. He then dropped the price to $12.95 million for the last time. That price cut drew a bidder, who paid only a touch more than the asking price for the posh apartment. Perry came out ahead despite the fact that the price was lower than his original asking price. The home was purchased by the smart celebrity for $12 million in 2011. Perry is said to have purchased the beachfront home from Southern California developer Scott Gillen, who had totally renovated the circa 1960 structure. The result is a loft-like area with floor-to-ceiling glass walls that stare out over the Pacific Ocean. With two levels, four bedrooms, and 3.5 bathrooms on 5,000 square feet, the fab pad can accommodate a large group of pals. The main floor has an open living and dining space, as well as a fireplace, beamed ceilings, and stunning ocean views. The glass walls totally open up, expanding the living room to a deck that spans the length of both levels of the home. The lower level master bedroom, which features a sitting area, walk-in closet, and lavish bathroom, is reached by a floating wood and steel staircase. A state-of-the-art home theatre and an outdoor spa are also included in the property. Meanwhile, the terrace has lots of seating as well as a fire pit, making it ideal for watching the sunset. The open floor plan made the buyer swoon, according to Lewis Robledo, the Douglas Elliman agent who represented the buyer. The minute you walk through the door, you have a completely open and expansive view of the ocean. With floor to ceiling and wall to wall windows, Robledo says. Two decks on both levels spanning the length of the home, maximizing the outdoor space, also made it extremely compelling. This is the perfect getaway place. During the pandemic, Perry used the beach house as his personal retreat. He shared photographs from the residents on Instagram while he relaxed on his veranda or cooked cookies in the kitchen. Perry purchased the house for $8.5 million in 2011. So, why is Malibu such a sought-after destination for Perry? What distinguishes it from the rest? While other affluent coastal towns offer big mansions on lovely beaches, nothing compares to Malibu's affinity with its landscape. To live in Malibu is to live with the sea, not simply by the sea. This implies not just a plethora of surfing, hiking, and boating activities, but also tranquility that can only be found deep in nature. Malibu, with a 27-mile length of shoreline and a population of around 16,000 people, offers enough room to feel alone without being isolated. The city is home to famous clubs and restaurants, and Los Angeles is just 25 miles away. Perry has been on a selling binge, having put a luxurious penthouse in Los Angeles on the market for $35 million in 2019. He paid $20 million for the Mansion in the Sky, which takes up the whole 40th story of the Wilshire Corridor's prestigious Century Building. Despite the fact that it sold for significantly less than Perry had requested, the closing price made it the city's most expansive apartment sale since 2015, according to Mansion Global. With what seems to be wall-to-wall -wall velvet furnishings, a big master bedroom with vistas, and a home theatre, he refurbished the house to his liking. According to the advertisement with Greg Holcomb and Cassandra Peterson of Compass, Perry hired interior designer L.M. Pagano to remodel the interiors. Perry has hollowed out the room for a home theatre and decorated it with giant velvet chases and a wall-end screen, and the house now has a lot of plush seating and carpeting. Mr. Perry's trademark fixation with Batman is on full display in a corridor littered with memorabilia and figures from the renowned character, according to pictures from the house reveal. The home, which was built in 2010, has four bedrooms, including a master suite with a sitting area, fireplace, twin baths, and dressing rooms, as well as a great room with city views, an eating kitchen, and a games room. According to the ad, the property also has remote control drapes that open into four patios with breathtaking views of the city, from the Hollywood sign to the Pacific Ocean. The listing has been taken from the market. That's it for today. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to hit that like button. 
Don't forget to subscribe and turn on that notification bell so you never miss out on any future content we'll produce for you guys. We're signing off now, but we'll be sure to catch you all in the next one.